One of the biggest advantages of loaders among all of the heavy equipment is just how versatile they are. Of course, with a bucket on it, you can use it for loading loose material, or today we've got the excavator attachment on it, and we're gonna use it like a digger. So let's see how that works. With the excavator attachment, the attachment essentially works like the dipper or the stick on a traditional excavator or digger machine. When I raise the boom, that's effectively like raising the boom on a traditional excavator. And then when I curl the bucket or what would have been the bucket on a loader, that effectively is like bringing in and pushing out the stick or the dipper on an excavator. Then I will use the quick hitch lever to activate the actual bucket on the excavator attachment. And so in theory, everything works the way a traditional excavator would work, simply with slightly different controls. So now let's dig a few bucketfuls of dirt here and see how it works. So you can see how the controls essentially work the same. Now, if we want, we can pick the dirt up and load it into a truck or another carrier. Here we're digging in South Florida, so it's a pretty dirty sand mixture, but the powerful ram and the force multiplying design of an excavator's bucket curling makes pretty quick work out of just about any ground material. Alright, so there we go. That was about uh, eight minutes or so of digging. We've got a hole for our bamboo tree we're going to be putting in. And uh, I should also mention it's a little over 100 degrees out here, about 110 with the heat index and it's still pretty comfortable operating the machine. You've got the canopy of course, but also because it's electric, you don't have the heat of that big diesel engine under you. Not to mention just how quiet and nice it is.